Hello, lovely humans. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel or if you're new here, my name is Sarah. I am beyond excited to show you today what's inside this package. I just returned from Oshkosh in um, Oshkosh, Wisconsin, the largest fly-in in the U.S., I think. Look barely had thrown our bags back here before I'm ready to dive in and um, get into this exciting delivery. Uh, this is the Galen Leather writing box and I actually had this here before I left and did not open it which is a record for me in my <laughs> impulse control. So I this was a, a gift to myself. I had been given a monetary gift and instructed to use it for something just for me, which is lovely. I've been pining away for this for a long time. So uh, the purpose, aside from its obvious purpose, looking for a space that's sort of mine or making a space that's mine. And that's so um, challenging for me in my current situation at times. And I think that having something that can be sort of uh, used r ritualistically. By that I just mean the practice of um, opening it up and experiencing what's inside and having it contained in a defined space and being able to take it out and travel about. Um, anyway, we'll see how it goes, but I will open it straight away and show you what's inside and then um, hopefully load it up. I have a few things set aside that are sort of the things I use on the regular and see what I can fit inside the box. So I'm not going to do this neatly, <laughs> just gonna go after it. So I have enjoyed watching these unboxings and, and for those that load it up to see. And it's very exciting. Uh, before I started this video, I actually did a meditation on radical self-acceptance and just dealing with trauma, lack of self-compassion, and it was through the Calm app, which was lovely, and I need to do this often. Ooh, lovely box. A cute box could easily be reused for other things. Oh, I'm very excited. But anyway, one of the things in the meditation was about spiritual reparenting and doing things for oneself in terms of self love and self-care this would be that if I utilize it uh, for myself anyway I'm kind of all over this is a lovely box oh my goodness okay Let's out gently maybe silicone feet on the bottom the wood is gorgeous See the lovely latch. Wow. And I've understood that this can be utilized when it's open as a way to hold what you're working on so it doesn't slip down. Wow. Oh, it smells great. <gasps> this is fun. You can see the back portion. It looks like a leather backing with elastics and then six writing utensil spaces perhaps or whatever and uh, I did order also the leather strap I wasn't oh it comes with a little bonus how fun is that anyway I did order the leather strap I wasn't sure I would like it but then I thought how am I gonna carry it around and I thought it would be a uh, you know one extra step I wasn't I might not enjoy, but the more videos I watched on it, the more I thought that it made sense. We will, I'll put that on here after I go through what's inside. A little pouch that could be store things even in here. Hello there. We are so grateful to you for shopping with our family business. I've been a Given Leather fan for quite some time. Uh, knowing the story of their family and the tragedy that they experienced. Nice, some tea. I have quite a number of things I've purchased for them, from them that have all been um, leather covers. Um, never anything have I bought that was wood. It's really 
these stickers. Yeah. I like all this. What are these bigger versions? Larger ones as well. Nice. Handcrafted leather goods. Instructions on how to care for the box. It's all so well put together. Obviously high quality. The wood's incredible. These move very nicely. Let's see. That is quite secure. Use it like this. You know. Here with painting or drawing. Goodness. It is just as beautiful as I had hoped. Really so well made. It's just gorgeous. Let me see what it's like to put the um, strap on it. Toad it around. For some reason I thought it had a buckle. going to be able to do this. I thought it had an adjusting buckle. I'm sure this will get smoother as you use it. Perhaps there's an easier way to do this. Maybe this is a buckle and I am not. There is. Oh goodness me. <laughs> that would be why it was hard to put on. Okay. <laughs> I will. what carrying is like that way. The leather's pretty stiff right now, but I'm sure it will get more malleable once it's used. I'm not going to even stretch it that far. Didn't even put it to the second one because it's pretty tight. I'm putting that on correctly, but that's lovely. Oh yeah, that'll stretch quickly with use. Oh, fantastic. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's like secret treasure trove, you know? Everything you need inside the wonderland of experiences, the potential, the stories, things coming to life. Okay. I will not be careful with this as I'm not careful with things that I feel passionate about and their usage in terms of creating. And, you know, it's a, not that I will not take care of it, but um, <laughs> I use things. I want them to work for me and I want to be able to live and breathe and be myself, which is sometimes rambunctious and all around about. Okay, so I think I will try to load up some things. Again, this was an exciting little bonus I didn't know it came with. Um, here's, let's see, to just load up. Oh, you can see this. We'll start over here. Some scissors. What else would I put in here? Um, pencil. Watercoloring brush. No, it, it will be interesting to see what I actually need. It's tarot. I don't know what I do or not. Let's see. Field notes. I guess I should just see if it closes. Oh, and it does. So all of these things are pretty thick. And um, let me see if my... 
um, traveler's notebook that I currently have would fit in here. I'm curious about that. Okay. This is my Chic Sparrow um, standard size traveler's notebook and I have it pretty chunked up with, oh my goodness, I can't see, one, two, three, four, five, six inserts and placed inside that closes with ease. Wow. I don't know that I would bring that along all the time, but um, there is lots of room for things in here. Distressed ink, matches, candle holder, a um, pencil sharpener, Palo Santo, some washi, you can see that, a vial for additional water, some things for drawing, <laughs> oh, let's see, where would I put that otherwise, maybe I put the scissors over here, I would certainly play with this. Um, oh my goodness, watercolor. That I would want in here, you know, over the tarot. So let's see, I would probably, if I'm out and about, just take the current volume I'm working on um, with my beloved big pen <laughs> and um, clips to keep things in place. But very much tarot if I could fit it in there. Let's try to give it a Oh goodness, a tape runner. I would want that as well. Or just some things to write on or some stickers. I'd probably find a pouch, perhaps this lovely pouch would be a place to bring in stickers. So I don't think that will stay, but it might. here. The basic point is there's ample room, absolutely ample room for all the lovely goodies and treasures and things that you might need it, um, in a quiet private space, excuse me, in your um, home or out and about in nature, creating and taking time for yourself and whatever you choose to use this box for, but it closes with ease, absolute ease. This is clearly well made and secure. Um, perhaps the trinkets that I put in here that are rocks that are slamming around could be um, put in differently, but I just wanted to load it up with a few things to see if that was, if it would fit my main utilized items and definitely you know, perhaps I use this lovely pouch to house some of these things or something else. But there's additional space. I mean, there's, you could really cram this to the gills. And um, I am, I'm so, I'm almost speechless. This is exactly what I wanted. It offers me um, that little slice of space, that workspace, creative space that I want and need so much uh, to be taking time for me and um, this is just perfection. I am so glad this is how I utilized my um, monetary gift and it just stays up perfectly. I'm really, I'm blown away. It even has a great fantastic smell that's wafting out of the container but okay well if you have any questions about it, I was sort of in the moment playing with it. Thank you so much for 
being with me here today. I look forward to showing you how I'm actually using this out in the wild. We'll show you what's next in my journaling adventures, both writing and creating. I hope that if you decide to make this purchase, you enjoy it as much as I'm pretty sure I'm going to. So this is, this is lovely. Galen Leather has made an amazing product. I can't wait to play in it. So thank you again. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. I would love to interact with you. I am new to the YouTube world. Look forward to connecting with you, showing you some other things. Have a lovely day. Bye. Yee, it is so lovely. <laughs> I can't wait to play with it. Ah, the strap's pretty cool too. Can't believe I couldn't open it at first. I'll figure that out, I'm sure. Humans, see you next time. <laughs> okay, time to really play. Bye.